Okay, so today I'm just gonna show you a quick comparison of the SanDisk Extreme Pro and the SanDisk Thumb Drive that's got USB-C and USB-3 convertible, USB-2. And so, of course, um, this is like an external hard drive, whereas this is a thumb drive. And this was pretty premium, pretty expensive, top of the line. Note that the Extreme Pro is different than the Extreme, even though it looks the same. And we do have a video on the Extreme Pro entirely separately, so you can check that out in the description. Whereas this is was really good value for 256 gigs in this form factor. That's the USB Type-C. And... Pretty nifty. Although this being an external, it's still pretty, um, it's still pretty mobile and it's actually got good dust and water resistance. Although you want to be careful with that, of course. Not really, it's not really great, but it's just good for a hard drive. So I'm going to do this quick speed test to compare. I've got, I'm going to take a, um, a 1.9 gig Final Cut library, with, which is a bunch of videos going to drop it into both of these and we'll look at the clock. So I'm going to drop it into these um, and we'll see how long it takes. This is more for like, you know, if you're moving videos, large files like that, um, etc. So one in there, one in here, and let's watch them go. And it's, it's done on the Extreme Pro, finished like right away. On this one, it's going to take about a minute. It's a relatively small one. Um, but some of these, you know, are 10 times as big, 20 times as big. Um, it's not really feasible to be moving huge files all the time on this thumb drive. Whereas this one, it's great for that. You know, if you take a look at a document type application instead. So let's cancel this. I'm going to drop some documents into here. And then here, I mean, it's instant for both. So it doesn't make a difference. I mean, if you're moving huge files huge folders with lots of presentations and pictures and all that, maybe you'd see a little difference, but like this really comes into play for moving huge files all the time. Moving these, some of these might take half an hour versus 25 seconds. Let's see, for example, on this one. And so that's really a quick comparison of these two, um, what they do. Um, they're both great drives, different sort of value level, different applications, but really great. So, you know, this bottom one here is gonna take 18, 19 minutes. This one's taking 10 seconds. And I mean, probably took 25 seconds in total. And uh, if you have any questions about these or if you've used any other drives, we were looking into a lot of different drives when we got this one and we decided to go with, the, with this one really because of the speed and the all around just quality. But we were thinking of building our own. So if anyone's done that um, with like one of those super fast SSDs and uh, an enclosure that could match its speed, I'd love to hear it. But uh, let me know in the comments if you got any other questions and thanks for joining us.